Currently, the anatomy of the sylvian fissure and its dissection are taught through the use of 2D diagrammatic images, lectures and surgical observations such as these presently shown. This animation demonstrates an anatomically correct 3D representation of the dissection of the sylvian fissure, which is a key process in the successful clipping of a cerebral aneurysm. This model was generated through the utilisation of real patient CT and MRI scan data. In order to approach the sylvian fissure for the purposes of aneurysm dissection, the patient must firstly undergo a frontotemporal craniotomy. Burr holes are drilled into the skull around 3 cm surrounding the terian fissure. The bone is then cut using a craniotome where the bone flap is removed and the dura mater is incised in a semicircular manner around the sylvian fissure. The sylvian fissure, also known as the lateral sulcus, is the most prominent landmark on the surface of the human brain, dividing the frontal and parietal lobes superiorly from the temporal lobe inferiorly. Due to the fact that the middle cerebral artery courses laterally deep within the sylvian fissure, one way to surgically manage an MCA aneurysm is to dissect through the sylvian cistern, exposing the middle cerebral artery and its branches. To begin with, using a round arachnoid knife and gentle suctioning, the sylvian cistern is incised from the distal portion of the sylvian fissure, where it is noted that the majority of surgeons undertake a distal to proximal approach in order to expose the early branches of the middle cerebral artery. The sylvian veins are gently retracted to the temporal lobe side of the fissure in order to prevent them from collateral damage. The arachnoid of the sylvian cistern, which may be adhered to the pia mater of the brain, is carefully cut using a mixture of blunt and sharp dissection, expanding the opening of the sylvian fissure and allowing the identification of the middle cerebral artery, its branches and the implicating aneurysm. After the completion of the dissection of the sylvian fissure, the intracranial aneurysm is carefully dissected away from the surrounding vasculature, where one or more specific aneurysm clips are applied to the neck of the lesion.